Let's see, did my teammates die? Yeah. They're all glass cannons. Makes them real good for, uh, for wrecking shit, but... Not great for the whole survival thing. Hopefully the neurals will help, but... I mean, I think in both Azrael and Gemroth's case, they have like three or four glass shards, so... Ooh, survival. Let's see, we could probably do a shrine, uh, shrine of the mountain. Maybe? I mean, it's one of those where it's like... It's probably stupid. And we probably shouldn't do it. But I certainly enjoy the, uh... I'm not gonna say the challenge. I certainly enjoy, uh, the ridiculous loot that we get afterwards. Yeah, I enjoy the items, and I realize that that's probably going to be our undoing, but like, oh well. I mean, Hubris is like my number one mortal enemy here, so if I ever find the guy, I'll strangle him, but until then, I don't know. I guess he'll just keep sniping me in the back. Actually, I have too much money. That's a hard find. We actually it looks like we've cleaned this place out pretty quick. There's probably more, but I don't really know. Bustling fungus. Not really my favorite. Not really even remotely useful. Okay. I don't see anything else. I'm gonna head for the teleporter, probably. I didn't check this out here. Yeah, there was like a handful of items, but whatever. Blazing Beetle Queen, eh? Hello. I hope you liked your BF Enema. Ammo. So I'm doing alright. I would like to get my HP up further, but there's not. Apart from the infusion, there's actually nothing else. I kind of missed that... What was it? It was like Bitter Ginger or something like that that you could get in Risk of Rain 1. That was actually, like, amazing. Uh, buffing your HP up. Like, especially in conjunction with, uh... with infusions. I miss it. I also miss the thing that just gave you, like, natural health regen. Yeah, Bitter Root. There we go. I was like, I knew... It, it looks kind of like Ginger or something something like that. But yeah, Bitterroot was fantastic for getting your HP all the way up. Gemroth is dying a lot. Yeah, he went with Glass. He is very, very killable. Increase your HP by 8%. Yeah, but if your HP was like 5,000, 8% is a lot. I mean, honestly, kind of always 8% is a lot. Okay. Well, Altorio, don't pick up any more glass. I might be able to carry this team, but it's gonna get start getting hairy. Oh my gosh. Well, that helps. That helps a lot. That's that's some infusions. All right, so that that solves one of my big issues. Which is specifically having enough HP to just kind of live through everything. I'm going to be immortal. Uh, maybe.
I'm not necessarily so sure about that, but that's okay. Uh, let's see. I'm gonna hit the teleporter if you don't. Cause yeah, there's there's nothing here. I also hate this level. It's not bad, but yeah. Hey, you gotta kill twelve thousand enemies. Eh, it should be doable as long as I don't pick up the Shrine of Order. Picking up the Shrine of Order is gonna be a death sentence. Hey, another healer site or harvester site. Okay, gasoline. Fireworks? No. My attack speed is feeling particularly anemic, so I would like to buff that up as much as possible. Okay. Hey! Actually, don't think I've found that this this entire run. Ow! Whoa! Note to self, do not, do not pop those. Okay. Hey, those explosive explosives are bad. Oh, by the way, there's a shield generator, uh, 3D printer there. If you flimsy suckers wanna wanna try and buff that up. Because that seems like it would be wise. Actually, there's two of them. Okay, do we got anything else particularly exciting? It's mostly like little things. Oh, Gemroth disconnected. Yeah, would not surprise me. Oh, does that mean all of his stuff is gone too? Okay, next time we do this, I'm gonna get the uh, rejoin whenever mod. Either that or Gemroth got tired, but I wouldn't be surprised if it didn't get laggy. Wake of Vultures. If I remember right, Wake of Vultures was not great. Oh, yeah, Wake of Vultures is risky. I'm gonna drop it. I don't know if anybody else wants it. Unless they unless they changed it. Is Wake of Vultures been fixed? I guess I'm gonna grab it for the time being. Yeah, Gemroth got tired. Okay. Yeah, I figured as much. It is stupid late. Well, it's not stupid late for you. But you did say that you were very tired going into this. Okay, guess uh, it's fixed, but it still sucks. Hey, as long as it doesn't screw me over anymore, that's fine. Okay, do we want to hit the teleporter? I could do the missile launcher. But I don't know if I care. Let's see, how many times through have I been? Uh oh, hey Derf. I've been I think this is our eighth or ninth uh stage total. We're not that far in. We should probably really just keep hitting those teleporters. What does the super dro drone do? At this stage, die. Okay, well, I'm a powerhouse, so that's okay. Yeah, eighth stage, yeah, sorry. We've been going kind of slow, because we've got, like, buttloads of... We've got buttloads of uh, chests to buy, and also we keep hitting Shrine in the Mountain because it's making us ridiculous. Which has been a lot of fun. I'm surprised. I don't think I've gotten a single... Yeah, I don't think I have a single Will-O-Wisp. There we go. Now I do. Oh, 
was actually, I was kind of shocked about that. I was like, I, I feel like I should have several more of these at this point. Now oh, he left. Dang bastard, bailed. All right, there he goes. Yeah, even without the glass, okay. I'm feeling pretty hale and hearty. Oh, I could use, I could use some of these. Well, I'm feeling appropriately powerful at this point. It's just a matter of making it to the end. So, yeah, Altorial and Azrael, if you guys are up for it, let's just, um, ooh, let's hit that. Uh, let's just start plowing for portals before it gets uh, too late on us. Oh, this is the, uh, this is the obliteration one, isn't it? Uh, how does this work? Is there a way out of here without obliterating our, obliterating ourselves? Oh, another portal will spawn. Okay, good. I thought it was the shop. Enter portal. Well, even then, uh, that actually really isn't that much of a goof. Okay, 13,000 for, uh, for a golden chest here. Let's see, how many lens maker glasses do I have? Eh, I'm, only, I'm only sitting at a 50% crit rate. I would like to buff that up, if and when possible. Okay, do we have any more? There's a Shrine of the Mountain. Do we go for the Shrine of the Mountain? Yeah, we go for the Shrine of the Mountain. So far, hasn't screwed us. Okay. So far, so good. Grab that. Ooh, grab another fuel cell, always. Uh, let's see, do we have any others? I've got enough for that golden chest if it hasn't been popped open already. Nope, it's... It's been bungled. Alright, what about the other one? It's also been bungled. Any other on the map, or am I the last party? Oh, and there's a brilliant behemoth, too. No! Oh, there it is. What do I get? A good one, or eh, I'll take it. Not amazing, but I do heal myself kind of constantly. I'm assuming this one's bad. I'm gonna hit the teleporter because this place is becoming unplayably laggy, and I know we can. I know we can farm a lot, a lot more. Oh, no, it's it's still there. That's well, okay. Somebody else will be able to buy it. Assuming we don't live live through this. Let's see, you're at 50% crit. Yep. Yeah, so I'd like to get some more glasses when I get when I get the chance. Ooh, overloading magma worm. Those are spooky. I do not want to be near that sucker. Problem is, I don't, I don't actually know where it's coming up. It's somewhere around here. Because, yeah, no way in hell is it dead already. There it is. Ooh, you are fast. Oh, boy. 
Oh, there's two of them. Of course there's two of them. Well, we do it. There's actually probably three now that I think about it. And the others? Yeah, the problem is because they're overloading magma worms, that actually makes them really annoying to hit. I should have had Jemroth uh, dump his entire inventory before he left. That actually would have been the really smart thing. Just had one of us just, like, grab it all. Because, yeah, I could have just clicked through it. If any of you guys have to go, just uh, let me know next time. And I'm just... I'll just, uh... Slam a jam. Everything down. And then somebody's gonna get twice as powerful. It doesn't necessarily have to be me. We'd probably just, like, all kind of ring around it and then just charge for the body and just grab as many things as we can. That would be really amusing. I would enjoy that. I honestly can't see what's going on anymore. I Am I on fire? I was on fire, but my HP regen is actually so good, I don't think it's a problem. Let's just stand still for a second. Pop out of the way if I have to, but... I am a little tired. Let's see, you sure you can't... Drop all their items now after everything's dead. Interesting question. I can check. My assumption is no, but that is a good point. Whoa, boy. Okay, so I can just... I can survive a direct shot from one of those guys. That's actually really, really comforting to know. It's still in the stat screen, so maybe. Okay, I'll do it on the next, uh, as soon as we do the area transition, I'll just sit, sit there and see if I can empty it all out. Because that'd be great if I could, uh, loot, loot Gemroth for everything he had. Admittedly, that includes multiple glass shards. Which would be a problem. If you got a dollar for every time you're tired, you never have to work again. That's true of pretty much everyone. Not a whole lot of people that are truly boundless with energy. Alright, we're good. Did you just... Did you snag every single one of those? Eh, whatever. Can't honestly blame you. You probably need them more than I do, anyway. Have fun with the in infinite jump. I'm gonna stand here with the... the... no. Uh... Let's see, it does not look like it can... It also does not look like it can drop anything for Altorial. But why? I like some of those neurals. On the other hand, that actually does make you considerably beefier. Okay. Let's see, do we have any other shrines in the mountain in the area? Because we should probably pop those and then hit the teleporter. Let's see, anything else? Let's see, a couple of challenges. But I'm not seeing any... anything else. Okay. We got over here. Mystery, stealth kit, nope. Most of this is garbage. Also, I think I disagree with the, uh... 
I think I disagree with the statement that the, uh, the gain in effect from elite enemies is kind of worthless. It's not terrible, it's more or less just giving me an extra 50% health permanently. Which is actually quite nice. Ooh, hey, there we go. There's, there's what I'm looking for. There's a little bit more AoE and flat damage. All right, I'm hitting the... Oh, I think you, you already got it. Yep, you did. Getting real laggy up in here. Though it's kind of it's kind of magic how functional it still is despite everything. The beam is your favorite item. Mine too. It's it's just so much fun. I I would say it's probably better on someone like Multi or the Commando, where you can make more use of that AoE by like just slapping things. Whoops. I'm not actually sure if that hit me. I'm not actually sure if I'm particularly damageable. I can more or less just float around. Oh, hey! More crit. Perfect. I think that was just random drop. Random drops have not been particularly forthcoming in this so far. And look, more bandoliers! Not that I have any immediate use for those. Oop. I think I got it away. Pretty sure I did. Ammo. Ow. Okay, do not stand still. Doink. Bandoliers are mine. Not nearly as exciting as Neural's. I think I also got a lot more uh, things specifically for my Beetle Guard. Which. I think just means I have more beetle guards. I don't know if it scales up their stats or if it just gives you more of them. I honestly have no idea. Nor do I care that much. Three. We're only at 68%? Damn. That is not enough. Faster game, faster. I think I might actually get the uh, the mod that once you kill the boss, you can teleport out. Yeah, they're not helping with the lag, though. Yeah. I really wish it actually just gave you a progressively bigger beetle guard. Because that would actually be some kind of magic. Did I just get a bandolier off of one of those falling dudes? I think I did. <laughs> Look at them go! Dude, what's the blue item on the ground? Probably actually just a visual effect. Yeah, that's just a visual effect from this thing. Let's see, Glenn stacking only raises max number. Does it not scale up their stats at all? Get a fuel cell. Wow, that guy that guy hit like a small truck. Another red whip. I really should probably not have so many of these. I've just been picking them up on, on reflex. Well then then again, like after a certain point, I just stopped sprinting and problem solved. Oh wow. Okay. We should probably just go hit the teleporter. Then again, how am I ever going to spend any of this money? I guess that's the real secret. I just won't. And that's fine. Okay. Just gonna leave that there. 
And they're... It's weird. It's like they got real tanky for a while, and then they got kind of weak business. Beetle guards should be like turrets and inherit items. That would be cool, but I think that would support my th theory that there should you should only have one beetle guard. I mean, honestly, I just think you should only have one beetle guard, and it just gets a little bit bigger with every single progressive upgrade. So stop pulling me, and I wish to buy this chest. I have a proto bobble. Thank you. There we go. I'm a little bit worried. They do a lot of damage. Look at these missiles. Be like 10 stacks or something just spawns a beetle queen for you. Yeah! That would be pretty rad. I would like that. Doesn't work that way though. But it'd be rad. Are you within range? Yeah, you are. I still don't have a 100% crit rating, but like, eh. I got worried for a second that that killed me. The just flash of red as that thing exploded it was like, eh, this. It's worrying. Oh, on the on the plus side, uh, when we get back to the red zone, I'm more or less going to be able to buy a bunch more golden chests. Hey, thank you, Jambas, for the 220 bits. Okay, seeing as everybody else is going that way, I'm going to go the other way. I'm never going to run under money at this point. Hey, there we go. I'm slowly creeping my way up to 100% crit ch chance. I think I'm at a solid 70. Ow! Well, there was a greater wisp there, but I think it got murdered. Oop. And nowhere near those things. Hi. That's a bad dune strider. Oh, did we... Really all already hit it? I guess we did. I really wish this teleporter would get, uh, like the AOE for the teleporter would get progressively bigger as you go along. Damn it, did I just get another bandolier? I did. On the plus side with those old war stealth kits, I take damage and I pretty much go invisible for, like, a minute. Okay. Hey, another harvester site. I will take, gladly. Now, do we have a shrine in the mountain on this one, or is this just a re totally regular, totally normal shrine? Yep. And it has got... Eh. Reynolds bands. Not what I would call particularly exciting. Not terrible, but not exciting. Uh, let's see. Anything else for me to even shoot? All dead. Every last one of them. Oh, it makes my life easy. Out of the missile stack, just more damage. Not really exciting either. But, I mean, we're kind of past the point of exciting, and now we're just on the point of just like, the more things I can stack, the better. I still wish some of the, uh, some of the items would scale in a more interesting way. But there's only so much you can do. Like, it would be kind of nice. Ooh, Celestial Portal? Oh, Celestial Portal. Actually, we might as well go through it anyway. Ah! Hi!
Thank you, friends. Dudes. Okay. I'm gonna head for the portal. We can spend our money on the next level. You have more chances of proc with the clover on. I actually do not know what the, uh... I do not know what the 56... 57 leaf clover does. With this setup. How many, um... Is there a way to see how many stages we've done? Doesn't look like it. That's unfortunate. Welcome to Lagtown. How is it going? Oh boy, those are pricey. Maybe worth it? Afterburner. Eh, it's okay. Okay, we got anything else? I don't know if we have any more of the big golden chests. They got pricey. I also am kind of out of money. I thought I was, wasn't was going to be, but no. Oh. Uh-oh. Okay, we should hit that teleporter instead of sticking around. I say is I just stand here foolishly. You get one frame a second and died. Yeah. Uh, let's see. Teleporter's over here. I'm gonna go pop it. It's it's time for us to go. This place is rad for loot, not so rad for survival. Well, survival. It's not so rad for uh, frame, frames per second. Ugh. That's another overloading mega worm. On the plus side, we have gotten considerably stronger. I'm pretty sure I didn't have the... Uh... I'm pretty sure I did not have my... Uh... Blazing Behemoth until recently. I wish to help fight, but I guess it's probably after Asriel. Okay. I'm just going to... I'm just gonna wait here and assume you've got it handled wherever the hell you are. Go over there. Oh, came back. Welcome back, creature. I actually do quite a lot of damage to this guy. Yep, as long as I don't stand next to it. Or on it? Actually, I think I killed that one. I can only imagine what he's dealing with over there. It's pretty boring on this end. Yep. yep, Azriel died. Alright, it's all me. It means I get all the goodies. Okay. I believe in me and my decently large pool of health. Has a lot left on the overloading magma worm, though. That is the one fear. Should be okay. Now that's only one of the overloading magma worms. Supposedly there's more somewhere. I guess I'll find them shortly. 
Let's see, Wonder killed the the gold titan. Yes, I already killed the that, that was I think that was like one or two loops ago. Probably maybe even three. It's been a while. We've we've been on this run for uh, an hour. A little over an hour actually. Oh, I took some damage. I took I touched something that was on fire. Well, I'm back up to full health. I I'm assuming something reduced my maximum HP badly. Okay, so where's the boss? Over here. Maybe? Yeah, there it is. It looks like it's stuck. Holy shit! That is a lot of special effects. At least I got a lot more room to maneuver. Let me try and drop the glands in, a, in an attempt to get rid of the lag. Maybe. The problem is the glands are fairly early in my inventory. How do you never use your blink? And it's really funny. I don't need to. It also keeps me out of the air. Like, I can use it, but... Most of the time, it doesn't matter. Is that the only one? Yeah, that's that's the last one. Why is that one guy just, like, healing like crazy? Is that one of mine? Oh, yeah, that is my Elder Lemurian. What the hell is going on with him? Why is he healing, like, 4,000 HP per second? I wish to know and understand. Ooh, that got him. Okay, well. I get I I got my neurals. Okay, I gotta I gotta kill everything that could threaten me. Then I'll see if I can drop my, my beetle glands. Uh no. I don't I honestly don't think I'm gonna be able to do so. I did. Okay. Shame I lost one of my fuel cells in there, but I'm not using a BFG that much. And I also lost my red whips, which means I can actually move at a re regular speed. Which is good. Oops. That's a leeching seed. Actually, in retrospect, a leeching seed might not be a bad deal. Why are you so beefy? Give me a second. I'm just gonna grab a small handful of things. You're not that good. Where's the, uh, where's the full butter? I missed them all. Just gotta make sure I don't accidentally plow straight through everything. Okay. Well, there we go. So, my attack speed, I think, just got stupid. We'll see. Wait, is that the first bandolier you've ever gotten? That's incredible, actually. I don't think I'm animating attacks anymore. No, I I, I do animate the occasion one. Another Nakana's opinion. I'm keep I keep waiting for like the dagger or something to show up, but no, no dice. We melting. Okay, uh, let's see. Another leeching seed. It strikes me that you guys have some somehow ended up with like significantly more focused builds than I. I'm not entirely sure how or why. Okay. 
I think that's the meat of it. Unless there's something like really amazing over there. I think I'm just going to hit the teleporter. Okay. That should be good. How's that? It looks like we only have one Blazing Stone Titan. That is a weird feeling. Like, I'm so used to having just like half a billion. Enemies. I guess we had two. Carl. It's always a competition for the barrel. That's okay. I just wish to become the beefiest man. What difficulty is this on? It's actually on Babby mode. We're trying to get to, uh, 20. I... I figured I wasn't gonna make it on Monsoon difficulty, so I just cranked it up. Or cranked it all the way down. We'll go back to regular difficulties at some point, but... I mean, so far it hasn't been any less deadly. Mostly. Kind of? It varies. I was going to hang up there. But in retrospect, standing still is a bad move. I'm just going to vote. Forever. And no mods whatsoever. I have so many mods. And I will only get more. Because this game seems to be able to take them with, like, limited complaints. You know, it gets, it's getting a little laggy on the fourth zone. But I want to say that might actually just be endemic to the game, not the mods. Because I know, like, Risk of Rain 1 would definitely get pretty laggy by the end. Like, incredibly so, honestly. But no, any game that has mods, I will mod. Even if it doesn't really make a whole lot of sense or is necessary, I will do it anyway. Sweet. Pop in that teleporter. We gotta go fast. I do not know... How many more we have to do? bullets. Very welcome. Ow. This is becoming a bit of a special effects fest. Which I complain about, but it's not really that big of a deal. Is that? Nah, it's not that good at all. I mean, it's like, it's okay. I guess my attack speed is not actually as good as I would hope it would be. I guess I only have six, uh... I only have six soldier serums. So yeah, not that I get much of a choice, but if I can build for more, I will. Three. No. Wow. That got hectic. I don't even know what I'm getting. Chrono bobbles. Chrono crobbles. No neurals. Disappointment overfloweth. Wee. I think I was getting lasered by all of them at once. I could be wrong. At DPS. Yeah, we. Well. I haven't picked up glass yet. I don't know if I'm going to. I'm probably not. Considering I, I need to be the one to survive. But I don't need to be the one to survive. <laughs> they don't survive long. Damn! And this was the run that we were actually... Like, it was getting dicey there for a second. I guess it still gets dicey. Everybody else died on the, uh... On the Firelands. And we lost Asriel there. Oh, shit, we lost me. We lost all of us. 
Well, how many how many did that go? What even happened? I'm pretty sure they popped as soon as they spawned. 16 stages completed. Damn. Oh, brass contraptions? Really? Yeah. They must have one-shot us. All of us. With, like, weird homing shots. Alright. Well, next time. I mean, to some degree, losing all of Gemroth's items was unfortunate. Because we actually could have used those. But, eh. It's life. Well, that was fun.